Now we are going to create users. To create users, you need to go admin department, user management. So before create users, you, you need to create employees. You already created the employees, so I am going to this user management. Then new user, select the employee name, for example, Jan, and permission to sales department and the location main location and the user id same name j o h n this is uh, this username john also uses uh, while logging the skill server john in client system and the password also john at j e r p jyoti j for jyoti j e r p so that means that mean the username is for SQL server username is John and uh, yeah, password is John or to you J E R P yeah note note it down then John password I will give one two three four five six login password one two three four five six then you have any email address Suresh Suresh Jyoti J V at gmail dot com then you have any security questions you can give then create it yes then user will create it this is the job okay you can deactivate it and you can also give the rights also for example full rights editing read only and something and also you can add, add more departments add departments you can add so you already assigned the sales department now i am going to assign purchase also so this this user can access both purchase and sales then add then close so now while installing in uh, so, sorry so you can install in the uh, same software in the client system also then so i rerun that application I am logging with the uh, user John J O H N and uh, password is one two three four five six. Then login. No John, there are no uh, additional settings. There is only sales, purchase, some user settings, view, help, and some of the options also here. Uh, masters, transactions, reports depend upon the user rights. Okay, I'm going to exit.